Have you read the news lately? We live in a troubling time. Our most cherished ideal of governance, democracy, is under attack everywhere. Quasi-totalitarian regimes are increasingly common. Political extremism fueled by hatred and racism is on the rise, and parliamentary systems seem gridlocked and unable to do anything but bicker. It's no wonder that so many new books have been published recently about the impending demise of democracy. They're all eloquent in decrying its flaws, but they seem unable to offer an alternative. It's easy to point out problems, but tough to come up with workable solutions. It's a similar story when we look at our free market economic system. It has made many of us prosperous, but we also know that it's creating inequality on a staggering scale, and it's destroying the earth at a breathtaking pace. Why can't we fix it? The experts offer only piecemeal, impractical solutions like universal minimum incomes and cashless economies. The same can be said of our systems of justice, education and healthcare. They're failing us, but no one seems to know how to change them. What if all these problems were connected? What if they're all symptoms of the same disease? A fundamental dysfunction of the intellectual model that supports modern civilization. What if we're trapped in a structure that cannot be fixed? We dash here and there, trying to plaster over the crumbling masonry and patch the leaky roof, whereas we should be knocking it down. And building something new. How do we do that, and what shall we build in its place? This is the aim of William Bissell's new book, The Next Enlightenment. It shows us how the project of human progress went horribly wrong because we created a logical system built around our basest instincts. As a species, we tend to rely on our survival instincts, hoarding, self-interest, and hostility to strangers, while ignoring the very qualities that make us human the ability to self-reflect and to raise our consciousness. The next enlightenment is a bold attempt to create a new logical system around the idea of elevating human consciousness. It proceeds to describe in detail how this will change all the principal areas of human endeavour, like government, justice, education and economics.